Hey everyone, Mango Sentinel here. How we doing today? Welcome to another episode of uh, this one's gonna be Aurora Legends. We've got our new patch coming out. It's really late, so I'm trying to be a little um, nice to my neighbors here. But we've got uh, a new character coming, and then another one coming right after. The first one is going to be Brent Hild. I'm just gonna watch this with you, um, since it is pretty cool, really well put together. Brunhild is the strongest Valkyrie ever. Strongest Valkyrie she's ever. She's invincible. She's a gaining little part of the endless war. Really Apparently, like her outfit. Brunhild really cool. Is a decent lady, but there is a, a sword instead of a spear, she's which is kind of weird. I think like that's a sword, or is that a spear? I can't tell. I guess we'll see when she attacks. That's a, that's a sword. Interesting. So she's got a bunch of cool things there. Um. Brunhild is a strong damage output hero. Strong Carrying damage output hero? High defense hero like Elliot or Lancelot. High defense tank then like Elliot or Lancelot. Yep, yep, yep. Then she gives the actual strength free reign like my Victoria. So that's pretty cool. I really like how they put that together. Really well done. Um, great everything there. So we've got Brynhild coming by Mamiko Noto. I'm not sure who that is, but I'm sure that's somebody important. Um, we can see a three star here. Uh, consumes martial stance, blessing all allies, and we have Shining Blade, attacks a single target, grinding two layers of martial skill to the caster and one layer of martial skill to one ally. Um, and the active increases defense strength of all allies and grants them one layer of martial. And the final DPS thing is a single target and grants two layers of martial skill to the caster. Um, also to note here, we're getting Dragon Lance made Ophelia as a skin. Heck yes, that that is awesome. Um, and of course, Brynhild is limited. That seems to be how they do things. Like, we just get continuous limited units, which is okay, I guess. Um, we can farm the base game, and then the rest are limited, uh, which you can pretty much guarantee you get from Pity. And this is the other one we're going to be getting here on the right side, Van Helsing, um, but I think he's going to be the six-person banner, so the one that comes out in, like, a week from now or something like this. And I think this banner comes out tonight or tomorrow. Uh, depending on when this goes down. So the event we're getting is a war festival, and honestly, their events are so confusing. I'm never really sure what's going on. Um, but we can see week one is Volda, and it's limited damage. Um, it says damage dealt to monsters is limited, requiring players to use multiple attacks, multiple segment damage skills, or increases attack speed. Okay, so what this means is individual hits are not going to hit for too much by the sounds of things. So you want somebody who hits multiple times, somebody who attacks a lot, maybe somebody who has um, uh, like a bunch of damage procs, like they, they, they get a bunch of different things to make them attack more than once. Um, week two is Saron, which is HP restore, and this is each attack against monsters will restore its HP. In this situation, players are discouraged from using multiple attacks, so it's literally the exact opposite week two, where we just want to hit them as big and as hard as we physically can. Um, I don't think that's going to work out too well for me, because I have um, Victoria, who seems to hit for a lot, a lot of times. And we have combination skill challenge in Kokama. Where's Kokama? I don't remember fighting a town with Kokama yet. I guess we'll see. Uh, it says skill attacks that aren't part of accommodation will be reduced. So this is where you want to use people who are just like common, uh, combination together like um, Lucent Finnell and uh, can I remember her name? Lucent Finnell and Vivian. Uh, the two combo attacks. I feel like that type of thing is what's going to do more damage. It also says each map is only available during its week and there's Eight different types of gift boxes uh, can be opened through the consumption of general box openers. Um, interesting. So cool, cool, cool. I love these boxes, to be honest, but I don't like how I can only buy them with gems. I never end up buying them. Um, lots of really cool things here. I'm guessing there's the 80 ones coming at the bottom. Yeah, so the orange eggs have level 80 stuff here. A virtuous guard here, elven guard boots. This is the stuff I'm starting to pick up. I just hit level 80, so... Um, really cool. Hilvin is another burn type weapon. Speaking of burns, I burnt my hand while I was cooking and I'm in excruciating pain right now as a side note. <laughs> but oh well, I'm trying to keep my mind off it by doing a video. Um, yeah, that's about it for now. This is going to be just a fun little patch with little events here and there like we always have with this game. Um, let me know in the comments below if you're going to be summoning for these units. I'm going to try, I think. 
especially for Brynhild. I'm not a huge fan of Van Helsing. I guess it depends on what he looks like, how um, his animations are in game. I have not seen that yet. But I, I do love the name Brynhild. Like, some of my favorite characters in every game I've played are named Brynhild. Like, in Fake Grand Order, I love the um, the Brynhild or Brunhild, depending on which one it is. Brynhild are there, maybe. Um, and in... What's the other one we played recently? Uh, Brown Dust also had a Brynhild um, that is awesome looking. So, really cool. Really excited to try this out. I love their events. They're just so wacky. You never know what you're going to get. And um, you never know which of them are going to be like a super hit. So I, I'm just excited to try this out. Anyways, uh, that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. Again, uh, if you want to join us, we are on Land of Ashes in the server uh, for the guild name Mangoville. In the description below if you want to download the game. Uh, so thank you so much. Have a wonderful day. Bye, everybody.